on a college campus thousands of miles away. From athletes doing the unthinkable, researcher Colin Meisel is performing his own Olympic event. <laughs> I don't know that I'd go that far. <laughs> yeah. Showcasing his ability to explain why medal counts go beyond athleticism. We're a nonprofit academic research center. Our primary purpose is to uh, look at long-term futures, craft different scenarios and say, what if? If this happens, what can change? Specifically related to things like Olympic medal counts, which you wouldn't maybe expect to be our focus. Believe it or not, medal counts are a driving force for international relations because to put it bluntly, Countries love to show off. Bragging rights, yeah, that's a simple way to say it. Yeah, bragging rights, yeah. Meisel says government interest is one of three reasons why researchers can easily predict who will be medal count leaders even before the games begin. The other two, population and the size of the economy. So the larger population, you should expect a country to do better. But uh, training for the Olympics is not cheap. Um, and so uh, you need sort of a, a level of wealth for people to be able to invest money. So GDP per capita or the size of an economy per person, on average, uh, as that increases, you're going to expect medal counts to increase. But Meisel admits it's not so black and white. A gold medal for Lee Kiefer and the United States. Athletes are incredible beings, often capable of defying the odds. History made in Tokyo. Jalisa Rosari, 9 News.